Hey, welcome back to Beyond Business Insurance, the channel that makes you a better buyer of your business's insurance. Hit subscribe below so you don't miss my future content as well. Today I want to talk to you about the only reason that you would ever talk with another agent and actually get a quote from another agent besides your current insurance agent. Now I, I know what you're thinking. You're probably thinking, hey, how do I make sure that I'm getting the best price? I need to get quotes from time to time just to keep my person honest. I totally understand all that. But there's only one reason it even makes sense to get quotes from, from someone else. And that's if that other person has a market that your current agent cannot get to. And there's only two reasons that this other uh, person you're talking to, other agent, would be able to get to a market your current agent doesn't have. The first reason is maybe that they, they have a contract with a carrier that your current agent does not have a contract with. So there's no possible way for your current agent to even go to that market and to get you a quote. The second reason, maybe that other agent you're talking to is actually a, a marketing representative or a direct employee of an insurance company. These are called direct writers and they sell to businesses directly uh, via their own sales force, right? So they don't go through independent agents. The one downside to that is that they can only bring you that one option. However, that could be a very competitive option. So maybe it does you know, still make sense to talk with that direct marketing representative. But again, I just want to reiterate, the only time it makes sense to talk with, uh, to get quotes from multiple agents is if they have a market your current person does not have. Any other reason you can think of, whether it's you're unhappy with service, you think your price is too high, you had a, a claim that wasn't covered, those can all be fixed by hiring an agent via a broker of record letter change. And you don't have to waste your time actually trying to get, go get quotes from an agent to, to make that change. So you can just make that change a lot easier by signing a letter that, that hires a new agent. Okay, I'll talk in future videos about the hiring process and some other things like that, but today I just wanna share with you this simple thought of don't ever quote with multiple agents unless they can prove to you they have a market your current agent does not have. If you like this video, subscribe below, give it a thumbs up, and thanks for watching.